Welcome back my dear student. This is Edwin from the future and I'm back here just to help you to prevent some mistakes in the future in your code. All right. So basically instead of replacing the, the lecture I like to make videos like this so that way you know that I'm always helping you out that I'm always coming back and helping you. All right. So anyway in the next lectures we are going to be creating a login update functionality right a update functionality. So we need some keywords right here in this select element we need ID right here all right so in this name attribute in the value field we are going to be putting ID we need this in order for us to update our database all right because we need to send this value so make sure that you have this set right now all right and even though you might not see me having this in the next lectures don't worry about it just make sure that you have a set all right you don't need to remove this because we will use this. Anyway, I want you to say hi to my Edwin from the past and you will see many of me in the future. All right. So many versions of me will always come to the course and help you out with anything you need or any mistakes we have made along the course. This is a, a very big course and I keep adding lectures all the time. So, all right. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next lectures. Take care.